This is going to be one of those off-topic videos that I like to do once in a while. And what I want to share with you is something special that I did today. And it was not cutting my hair. It was not pre-ordering the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra, <laughs> which I did. What I want to talk about is fasting and how I use fasting to stay on track with my diet and to stay strong and healthy. And I've shared with you 28 pull-ups and I want to do 30. When the channel reaches 3,000 subscribers, I'm going to record myself doing 30 pull-ups in one set, okay? So full disclaimer, I am not a doctor, I am not an expert, but I truly believe the best message you can get from me is about diet and exercise because I really, truly believe that what I do works. And if you don't have to do the same that I do, but if you just do a little bit of it, or if you go on that direction, I promise you, you will improve. You will feel the improvement and it's gonna be huge, okay? No matter what, because I've done exercises my whole life since I was a kid and I feel so much better and stronger doing what I do. And I show you the proof that it works. So what is fasting, okay? Fasting is basically not eating, just drinking water. <laughs> and we fast every day. When we are sleeping, we are fasting. So what I'm talking about is water only fasting. So you do not eat, and I would go as far as 24 hours, okay? Do not go beyond 24 hours if you are not medically supervised, okay? Because it can be dangerous. But 24, 20, 24 hours, I mean, anyone can do that. Unless you have uh, problems, like health problems that would not allow you to do it fasting, you're gonna be okay. So you can visit your doctor and ask your doctor if it's okay for you to stop eating for 24 hours and drink water. Maybe your doctor is not going to know what that is. <laughs> He's gonna tell you don't do it, then do not do it, okay? Just follow what your doctor tells you. But most people should be okay without eating for 24 hours. So why is that beneficial? So let's say you are used to pizza, hamburger, ice cream, super high stimulating foods, okay? And let's say that that is normal to you. You are in big trouble, okay? When that super highly stimulating food is normal for you, then <laughs> when you eat the good stuff, it feels like nothing. And your brain is gonna tell you, don't give me that crap, okay? That fruit vegetable, that's nothing, that doesn't have calories. Because your brain is designed to make you survive on an environment of a scarcity. But we are living today in abundance. We are surrounded by readily available, very high calorie foods, okay? And that is not necessarily the best for you, okay? So your brain is confusing you, <laughs> basically. It is telling you to eat the highest calorie foods you can get your hands on because that works on a natural setting. But on the world we are living today, that is making you sick, fat, sick, and miserable. That's the problem. So the problem is not you. You're doing exactly what you're supposed to do. The problem is the environment that is messed up. So what you need to change is the environment and not you. You are okay. You have, no, you have no issues, okay? Everyone likes the high calorie foods because that's what your brain is telling you that's the best, okay? So here's what fasting can do for you. When you stop eating for 24 hours, <laughs> obviously, <laughs> when you try food again, it's going to taste better, <laughs> okay? So here's what you can do. You stop eating that crap and all crap for that matter, for 20, 24 hours, and then you go ahead and eat the good stuff. And that good stuff, 
that was feeling like this is garbage now is going to feel like okay well that's not that bad <laughs> and that's how you can start eating better okay so you stop eating for 20 24 hours you keep drinking water it's not like drinking water like crazy just a little bit just sipping water just a little bit every 30 minutes one hour you listen to your feedback to your feelings and then after 20 24 hours you're starving <laughs> You're not, you're not gonna starve, it's okay. It's easy to do, no problem whatsoever. Then you go ahead and you eat the good stuff, okay? You eat your fruits, okay? Your vegetables. So here's the problem. When you eat whole grains, starches, fruits and vegetables, it is a challenge to get enough calories. So before, you were getting too many calories with a crap food, with super highly processed and concentrated crap. Now, it is the opposite. Now it is difficult to get enough to survive. So you need to eat more food. <laughs> so you need to stay healthy. You need to eat more, <laughs> not less. You need to eat more of the good stuff, okay? So the main source of my calories are starches and whole grains, okay? So do not concentrate in fruits and vegetables because fruits and vegetables are high volume, very small amount of calories, okay? So guarantee the whole grains and the starches and then eat as much fruits and vegetables as you like. One good idea would be to break the fasting with fruits. One good idea would be go to a farm like I like to do, I love to do that. I go to the farm, so I do fasting for 20, 24 hours, and then I go to a farm, and they allow you to, to pick the apples, for example, but you can eat all the apples you want. So I have a feast of apples. I stay all day eating apples, and at the end of the day, I pay for, you know, whatever I pay, but I actually I pay for one bag and I eat two of them. <laughs> Basically, I can eat in one day easily 30 apples, that's nothing. <laughs> and that's fantastic, okay? So if you're going to eat fruits, you need to eat a massive amount of fruits, not a little bit, a massive quantity, because fruits don't have a lot of calories, okay? There are some fruits that are higher calories and other but it's difficult to get enough to survive you would need to be eating fruits all day and that's fantastic you can actually try that it's, it's amazing for you but if you don't have all day to be eating then you need to eat whole grains and starches okay so then on top of that I do not eat oil that's the main problem okay zero oil eliminate the oil from your life that's terrible for you that's the worst thing you can get in your body okay so no oil and I also do not consume sugar no salt and no animal products okay but if there is one thing you can eliminate is oil and you will realize that most of the processed garbage that you can find on the store they have oil some kind of oil so just by eliminating oil, you are eliminating so much crap. And oil is terrible for you. Terrible for your arteries, for the blood flow, okay? So it's highly recommended. So that's it. Let me know if you have any questions. And again, do not go with fasting. Do not go beyond 24 hours unless you are medically supervised, okay? If you go to a fasting clinic, they can actually supervise your fasting and you can go as far as 30 days without eating, just drinking water. And that is absolutely amazing. And I want to do that myself when I have a chance, okay? But I need to pay, go there and, you know, stay, <laughs> stay 20 days, at, you know, 10, 20 days and doing fasting. So I don't have that time for now, but I want to do it. And I especially want to do it with my family together, okay? Because that's actually very, very beneficial. But it has to be on a control setting. It has to be medically supervised. You cannot do that at home, okay? You shouldn't do that at home. It is dangerous, okay? But 20 hours, 24 hours, if you don't have any medical issues, you should be okay. 
consult your doctor before doing it just to make sure everything is fine and you can do it and you're going to appreciate that so basically it's going to allow you to start eating better why because the natural food is going to taste a little bit higher it's not gonna be ice cream like of course not but it's going to be a little bit better it's gonna be like okay it's not that bad I can I can eat that so that's what you would need to get started on the right path so what I did today basically I didn't have time to eat today so I wake up I cut my hair I buy the S23 Ultra so I am deciding what color I'm going to get and 512 gigabytes which I got and the accessories and all of that and then I have to go to to do my classes my guitar classes so then I come back late so then I eat before going to sleep so I didn't get enough calories today but that's okay that's okay your body is going to balance out so tomorrow I'm going to have a feast <laughs> tomorrow I'm gonna eat a lot and a lot of good stuff I'm probably gonna eat a bunch of apples I'm going to do a you know, beans soup with sweet potatoes and eat a lot of food a lot of good food okay and the digestion is fantastic I feel amazing I can do a lot of exercises whenever I want I like to skate I can skate forever I can do 20 kilometers no problem <laughs> so anything I try to do it, it just works my body responds so much better and I, I've done exercise since I was a kid okay since I was a kid until now I've done exercise and even in my best days I was not able to do more than 10 or 15 pull-ups and now I can do 30 that's amazing and I am not training every day in fact I haven't been able to do pull-ups like in two weeks because it has been the snow has been crazy and the weather has been extreme for these days and I am confident I'm gonna be able to do 30 <laughs> once the channel reaches 3,000 I want to record myself doing 30 so this diet works amazing for me I've been doing it for almost I don't know three years almost very long time and the only vitamin that I take is a vitamin B12 again check with your doctor to see which one the dosage and if your doctor actually recommends you to consume that vitamin B12 but I know it is a water soluble uh, vitamin so if you get excess of it you're just going to pee the rest of it and it is a strong recommendation for everybody regardless of if you are vegan or not or whatever it is recommended it is good but check with your doctor okay that's the only thing the only vitamin that I consume this works great for me and if you don't do exactly what I do it's okay but eating a bunch of fruits and vegetables is not going to hurt for sure that's not going to hurt you so my advice is sound and I am giving you the keys the keys to my success so I'm giving you my secret what I do okay because there are some people that they do exercises they are fitness coaches and stuff and they are telling you do this and do that but they are not telling you their secret sauce which is basically they are on a bunch of asteroids <laughs> a bunch of crap that's why they look the way they look you know who I'm talking about basically those kind of people so they are giving you a bunch of philosophies and diets and things and routines that they follow and kind of exercises but they are not telling you they are taking asteroids and that's why they are <laughs> they look like that okay so I'm telling you exactly what I do and it works so let me know if you have any questions and 